This is the precise reason the 3RZ, the 2.7 liter Toyota engine, is basically known to burn exhaust valves up. So on cylinder one, we have a 5,000th clearance, so that had about 10,000 miles before it burned an exhaust valve. So in theory, if you were smart, not a mechanic, you could build up this fancy spreadsheet like my friend did for me, but I still like to go back to my paper. It may seem like a lot of work, but this gets pretty expensive. So make sure you go through and measure the clearances two different times because the shims are pretty expensive. So after you've double checked all your clearances, it's time to remove the exhaust camshaft. So they do make this like fancy rabbit tool that you can pull the shims out, but I just find it easier to remove the camshaft. After the camshafts are removed, you can pry the shims out of the buckets and then you need to measure every single shim that you want to change so that is when the spreadsheet really did pay off so what you're going to find is if these never been adjusted it will have almost all the same shims straight across the engine inside of the repair manual there is this massive chart to help you select the correct shim but it is basic addition and subtraction so if your valve clearance is too tight you're going to be using the minus number and if it's too loose you're going to use the plus number so on cylinder number one it's ridiculously too tight at five thousandths. With a shim installed of 0.112, we need to remove 0 0.008 or eight thousandths of an inch from this shim. So that would give us a sh new shim of 0 0.104. So now we need to convert this over to metric because the dealer only sells them in metric. So call them and ask them for a 2.65 shim. So you're gonna run into this problem where they don't have all the shims in stock, so get it as close as you can because you may get it wrong like I did even after all these calculations. So here's a massive tip here. These shims should cost you $15. I called three dealers, one was 30, one was 23, and then the honest dealer was $15. And they're also $15 on the yodashop.com. And I also would have ordered a whole bunch of extra shims because I had to go back to the dealership twice. The total cost of the valve adjustment so far is $140 to get this thing perfectly nailed. So remember you're shooting for 13 thousandths of an inch on the exhaust side and I would not accept an 11 thousandths, the minimum clearance. So on the 3RZ engine, it goes 10 to 14 thousandths and the 5VZ is a little bit looser. Maybe that's why the 5VZ doesn't burn up exhaust valves. 